this video gives details of WinViews tool that is used for accessing internal data from the EGPWS. The EGPWS provides an RS-232 I.O. port on the front and rear of each unit for test control and data readout. In case of Mark 5A EGPWS, a test Ethernet port is provided on the front panel only. These ports can be used for signal monitoring, viewing present status, and initiating byte tests. These interfaces are full duplex and are intended for human interaction but can also be used for custom interface programs such as Honeywell WinViews utility. The front RS-232 port is the preferred port for test control and data readout functions and is available both in air as well as ground. For non mark 5 a EGPWS, 32 or 64-bit terminal emulator program WinViews can be used. For mark 5 a EGPWS, 64-bit WinViews can be used. WinViews 32 can be downloaded from Honeywell My Aerospace portal as shown here. Sign in into myaerospace.com using your username and password. Select Services and Support, Software and Data, Software Support Tools. Scroll down and click on Download button against WinViews software. Select Show in folder, double click and unzip the software. Once the zip file is unzipped, double click on the file and unzip. Open the folder, double click on setup.exe to proceed with the installation. WinViews 32 runs on any PC with Windows 3.1 or higher. It also runs on 32-bit OS like Win7, Win8 or Win10. WinViews 64 is available for order through My Aerospace portal or you may send email to orders at honeywell.com. This version will work with any 64-bit operating system like Win7 and higher. Here is how the users can fabricate the RS-232 cable. Here are the details of user guide and CVT item reference list documents that are attached to technical solution article 43341 in My Aerospace portal that can be downloaded for further reference. Here is a demo which shows how to use WinViews. Please refer WinViews user guide for detailed instructions. Verify that the serial port of the PC is connected to the RS-232 port of the EGWS via a serial cable. Ensure that the power to EGWS is on. Start the WinViews on the PC laptop. Once the communication is established between EGPWS and PC, a prompt appears in WinViews as shown here. WinViews has two basic modes of operation, terminal mode and data display mode. Terminal mode is used to send commands to EGPWS and receive data responses. Data display mode can be used to assist in the system checkout when using an appropriate command file. In terminal mode, the user can type a command at the prompt. For example, when present status, that is PS command is typed and entered, the EGPWS configuration will be displayed. A command can also be selected from the drop-down commands menu. As indicated earlier, one can send CVT values to see the EGPWS response, see the flight warnings, faults, and ground history, initiate various levels of self-tests, by selecting the appropriate commands as shown here.
please refer WinViews user guide which gives details of various commands and scripts that can be used for accessing EasyPWS internal data. There is a VM solution to support the tools that have Windows OS compatibility issues. Refer still available in Honeywell TechPubs. Since most newer laptops don't come with a serial port, a USB 2 serial adapter can be used in such cases. In order to do that, you must first install the driver software that came with the adapter and then set up the COM port. If WinViews is downloaded from the Honeywell website using Chrome web browser, it might ask a password to extract the files. There is no password to unzip WinViews, but Chrome adds this requirement as a security feature. If you use Internet Explorer to perform the download, no password is required to extract the files. Refer Technical Solution Article 41325 published in My Aerospace Portal for latest update on this topic. We hope you enjoyed this simple video produced by Honeywell Aerotech support team. Have a great day.